Clutch Trucker filmed before a live studio audience. It's almost grooming time again. You see how furry he's getting? His, his ears are kind of getting all matted up. And I tell you, I have to deal with him more than I have to deal with my own hair. <laughs> I hope to get that cut tomorrow, though. Hey, YouTube. Thanks for tuning in to another edition of the Clutch Trucker channel. Yeah, well, that load I had uh, with Arc Bass did get canceled, but I finally did get one uh, today that's uh, heading to uh, Chester, New York. Picked up at Fresenius. I've never heard of them before, but uh, some sort of a medical supply company. So actually, technically, because of the rules that have been extended through the end of the year, I really don't have to follow the HOS rules while I've got this load because it's medical supplies. I'm still gonna, you know, come on. They've changed the rules and made things a little bit easier on us. Thanks to all of you who have commented on my uh, videos all about uh, Keep Trucking. Keep Trucking still thinks they're right and still thinks people like me and everybody else who's been calling them and talking to them are full of crap, which is just unbelievable. You know, like I said in my last video, they had five months to figure it out. And the fact that they haven't uh, interpreted the rules correctly, well, I'm sorry. That's not my problem. That's not the people's problem who are using your software, which is no longer valid. And as I've said to all Keep Trucking users, uh, you know, go to paper logs. You have the right to do that legally because the software uh, provider, Keep Trucking, is not giving you an accurate ELD device. So you have the right to go to paper logs legally. Believe me. Um, a guy named Chris Kelly, who's a cabbie in London, or in, the, in England, he's south of London, uh, has been following my channel since uh, my buddy John Branch did that new, uh, article for me, or about me, in the New York Times back in March when COVID really kind of started happening all across the country. Um, anyway, so he found my channel based on that, and he sent me some great video. You know, I've had a, a few different videos on here about tiny little roads and ridiculous access to places, and he showed me this tiny, tiny, tiny road in England that he has to drive down. So, Chris Kelly, we're heading to you. I finally figured out how to load down your video, or download your videos. So, let's go to uh, Chris Kelly from England. Hey Clutch, this is me, Chris, the world famous meatball cabbie over in Brighton, just south of London. You mentioned me in a video where there was some narrow roads, and I think it was in possibly Pennsylvania. Well, just recently I've been on a, a school run uh, and there's a shortcut down what is a narrow road even by our standards, which is, is, is it's barely wide enough for one vehicle. So I'm going to do a little bit of a video and send you a few little shots. Yep, this is a two-way road. <laughs> uh, the vehicle I'm driving uh, is a full... In the, in the States, it's a Ford Fusion. For some reason, Ford have given, a, have given this vehicle a different name, Mondeo. No idea why, it makes no sense. Uh, so if you can picture the width of a Ford Fusion, you can picture the width of this road. There are these little passing places here where you can pull in, but uh, if you come around the corner, and there's someone facing you, well, it's uh, it's your Mexican standoff and you, know, you, you either back up or if someone wants to be an ass wagon about it, then you get out and argue. Uh, not everyone's gentlemen over here, believe it or not. Um, so I, was, I, was, I drove down this road for the first time uh, a few days ago and immediately I thought of you, here's a passing place, I'm gonna pull in here take this video quickly in case someone comes because they're going to think I'm a right ass wagon that's the width of my vehicle on this on this a two way road there you go is that narrow I think this verge is actually being cut as well so it does actually get narrower hey crazy uh, thank you so much for your content uh, always keeps me entertained uh, Chris out how cool was that Chris, buddy, I hope you uh, can send me some more video anytime you want. Love your stuff, and thanks so much for uh, subscribing to my channel. Appreciate it, you the man. But even though my last load got canceled, um, Arc Best, not happy with you guys right now. They owe us money. There's a Tonu, you ever heard of that? 
truck order not used t-o-n-u so they owe us some money for ordering us you know to go to pick up the load and then it wasn't there it's their fault you owe us some cash for that you just don't get away with that and luckily the company i work for turquoise trucking is really good at making sure those brokers pay up when they do crap like that and uh, then Bo was awesome. He found me another load uh, that, that pays even better than that one paid. You know, so I'm going all the way to Chester, New York. It's paying me 5,500 bucks overall. Of course, I get 85% of that. Not a bad deal, baby, not a bad deal. So anyway, just wanted to kind of give you a quick update and let you know what's going on. And now look for the unboxing video of the OTR 1000 from Garmin. Uh, I'm gonna pick it up on Saturday. So probably Saturday night, you can look for that one to be posted here on the channel. And then I'm going to run it for about a week or so before I do my full-fledged review, okay? Hey, as always, thanks for tuning in. Please subscribe. Thanks for all of you guys who have been subscribing and my account's gone way up. Thanks for all the new viewers. Uh, I've got over 200 videos on this channel, by the way. Uh, all subjects related to trucking, some not related to trucking at all. I've got a video where I just do bad impressions. Uh, I mean, so... Hit the video tab and go scroll down deep. You'll find a whole bunch of different stuff. All right, so thanks for finding my channel. Thanks for tuning in. Really appreciate it. Uh, I'm just a hardworking uh, truck driver out here, and I do this as a good way for me to wind down from the day. I used to be in radio for over 20 years, so I kind of got to let my entertainment, you know, my need to entertain outlet out and this is a great way for me to do that hey uh like please comment i get your comments sometimes it takes a day or two but i get to them uh please ring the bell for notification as always sniff that magic youtube fairy dust clutch out